Hi YouTube, today I'm going to show you how to set up an Etsy seller shop in 2023. Let's get into it. First, you're gonna click on open shop today. I leave in the, the link in the description below. You're using my link, you get a free 40 listing. Each listing is called 20 cents, so you save yourself $8. So you put in your email address. You can connect with Google or Facebook or Apple ID. So, but I recommended using email. Don't, don't associate your SA account with all those social media. So you put your name in, your password. When you're done, you click uh, register and it's gonna send you to this page. You click, let's do this. Okay, right here. So you're gonna follow my step. I'm gonna click, I want to expand my online business next. Now you're gonna go down to the bottom. You're gonna pick selling internationally. And then next, this thing is not really important right here. So click start your shop. Now pick shop language. I'm gonna pick English and Canada. And I'm going to be using a US dollar for my shop. So once you're ready, you click save and continue. So right here is to put your shop name. You might have to pick a few names in order to find the available name. Once you're done, you click save and continue. And then it's going to send you to here. You make sure you put in information correctly because this is how you get pay. Okay. Uh, and after that, it's going to send you an email to confirm that you are the actual person. You're going to go confirm your email. Set up your credit card information. And right here, I see want you to set up a two-factor authentication. I'm going to pick the authenticator app because I don't want it to associate with my phone number. So I download the app. So then I scan that with my app and it will generate me the code. I put in the code. So once you've done that, you click continue and then you're going to come to this page. Get here, you're going to click on add a listing. So this is the fun part. So right here is uh, the picture mock, mock up picture. So you want to make sure you use a good mock up photo because you sell digital product, right? So you want to make sure that you can sell them with the picture that you put up. You want to maximize all the picture slot, use all of them. It will help you with your SC, SEO or video as well. It will help you. And the title pass, make sure you maximize all this space, okay? Put all the keyword that you need. You can, you know, you can uh, use comma to help uh, maximize the keyword that you put in there and help the algorithm that they can pick the keyword that you are using. Uh, okay, once you've done the title part, you're going to click this I did. Uh, you're going to click a finished product. You're going to click uh, 2020 to 2022. Right here, you're going to keep it at automatic. And right here is digital because you sell a digital products. So on description part, you want to spend your time, you know, put in a really good uh, description because uh, it, it's digital products. You want to make sure you sell them with this script, okay? Spend your time, a lot of your time on this part and it will help you with the SEO as well. Make sure you put in some keyword into this description. Once you've done that, you, you want to make sure you maximize all this tag. You use uh, 13 tag that it's given to you. Okay, use them all. But make sure you use the keyword that associate with your product. Don't use anything that's not related to your products. Okay, that's not good for SEO. Okay, maximize it. Put it up all 13 slot. Okay. Okay, when you've done that, you go down, okay, you you can put up the rest of it. So I'm going to stop right here. You're going to set up your price. 
and quantity you want to set up to 999 because you don't want to keep renewing your products and right here is really important you want to upload the file that you're going to be giving to your customer this is what when they buy it they're going to receive this file they can download this on Etsy. Uh, and then click save and continue. Oh, I forgot something. Uh, oh, okay. I, I forgot that I forget to put it in a category. You want to make sure you pick category that match with your product. So my digital card. So I'm going to find something that match with my digital card in digital print. So when it's done, then I'm going to click save and continue. Okay, here it's done now. Uh, this is your first listing that is up. Okay, you can click add more listing. You can add more or you can just click open your shop. But I'm going to click open my shop right now. Okay, now my shop is live. Okay, my shop is live here. I'm going to show you a few things that you that's really important for the new shop. First is uh, logo. You want to make sure you customize your logo. Okay, make sure your logo look professional. Okay, it's really important on Etsy. You don't want to just use anything. Just, you know, spend your time making some nice uh, logo. So this is, yeah, so upload on to both places. When you've done that, you can, you know, this part is you can tell a little bit about your shop, you know, the shop title here. Uh, just something that related to what you're selling, okay? Make it nice. Just look at a few shop and then you know create your from there. And now, so you go down to uh a shop announcement, okay? Shop announcement is really important when when they click, they come to your shop, they're gonna see this. So I usually welcome them with a discount. Okay, nobody, you know, everybody like discount. <laughs> so especially for new shop, you want to set up a discount code for, you know, visitor to use them. Uh, I'm going to show you how to set up a discount code after we done with our shop announcement. Let's just give them 20% off everything. Okay. This is just the example, okay? Just don't follow it. You can just make your own, but I'm just just want to show you. Okay, when you're done, don't forget to click save. Otherwise, you have to write it again. Okay. Okay, now go to marketing, select sale and discount. You want to click run a sale. So now you pick 20%. Uh, you can click the date that you want to run a sale. I'm going to start today. Uh, and then I'm going to end at the end of the month. So it's 31 day. I'm going to set the sale name 20 off. And pick the product I, that I want to discount. There's only one product here. Click confirm and got it. Now you come back to your shop. So if you refresh, you will see that your product is on sale. So now... Yeah, so you already did a few important things. Now, okay, banner. Banner, you can pick whether you're going to use a big one, mini one, or none, you know. Yeah, that's it. And this is how you set up a SD seller shop.